Hi, my name's Anita and I am from Oakwood Homes in Birchington and today I'm here at uh, Claremont Mews in Birchington. Um, I'm just going to show you, it's a lovely private little muse. Um, you've got your own parking space here to the front and then you've also got visitors parking both ends of the muse as well. So I'm just going to take you in now. It's a lovely terrace into the hallway, just going to pop the door shut. So I'm going to take you through to the open plan kitchen dining lounge, which is beautifully presented. So this is currently on the market for offers in excess of £375,000. The location is perfect. You're right by the train station that takes you into London and you're right by the village so you can walk into the village and all the amenities, the shops, the bars, the restaurants and you're walking distance to Beresford Gap Beach Bay and also Minnis as well if you prefer a longer walk. So the location is perfect. So as you can see this is a beautifully fitted kitchen. This property is only eight years old so all these um, Fittings are, are fairly modern and new. You've got a built-in fridge freezer there, high level oven, etc. here. So everything is in perfect order. Lots of storage. Boiler is housed here in this cupboard. There's a built-in dishwasher as well and an integrated washing machine there. Dishwasher situated here. So there we go. And you've got your gas hob here. Lovely workspace. And it opens up beautifully into this dining space as well. As you can see, it's nice and bright in here. And this is because we've got a lovely self facing garden. I'll take you to the garden at the end of the tour, but now we're entering into the living space. As you can see, the potential here is amazing. We've got a desk over in the corner, so you've got a study area. Bifold doors, which open up beautifully onto that south facing garden, so you can even sit inside with the doors open and enjoy that sunshine. So you can see this lovely open space. It's fantastic. So. This lounge area is 18.8 by 14.4. The kitchen diner is 16.1 by 10.2, so you've got lots of space. You've got a cupboard here as well, behind this door. So the properties are well thought out. So nice cupboard here for storage. Now, because they're only eight years old, actually, I'm going to take you through this way as well. You can see it just, you can walk right round. Um, you've got great insulation. So this property is an EPCC. I'm just going to show you there's a WC here as well. So economically, they're perfect. Obviously, with the cost of living being as it is at the moment, that's a really important factor. So you've got your WC here, which is ideal. Now I'm going to take you upstairs, but just before we do, let's just backtrack. Look at the size of this hallway. So as you can see, there's some furniture placed here. You can even use it as a little study area if you wanted to, but it's a great size. This property is 1,011 square feet. So there's a lot of footage here for a terrace home. It's perfect. So I'm going to take you upstairs now. Now this is a beautiful mezzanine area that we're going to enter into first of all. Now as you can see this is kind of like laid out so it's a nice place to relax, read a book. It's a great use of space. As you can see, the light is good again here. 
So it's a lovely area. And then you've got the view down into the lounge, which is perfect. It just makes the place feel so open. So the EPC rating is a B on this property. Council tax band is a C. I'm going to take you into the bedroom. This is currently used as another sort of study area, workroom, but obviously it's a really good sized bedroom. This is the smaller of the two, which is 13 nine by eight nine, but still a good size. Both bedrooms are situated at the front of the property. As you can see, looking out onto the front there. And we've got a little loft hatch here as well, with a good sized loft for storage. I'm gonna take you through to the master bedroom here so this bedroom measures 13 9 by 9 6 as you can see really really good space so this is a private muse um, and the residents pay 180 pounds per annum currently that's for the upkeep of the roads, etc. Any repair works that need to be done. The road is in immaculate condition. Um, the muse is kept very well by all the residents. It's a nice area to live. Um, as I say, it's got lots going for it with the location, etc. And here is the bathroom. So this is, again, beautifully presented. This measurement shower room is, as you can see, a really good size. Just coming through around here, we've got the shower. Good double shower here. Lots of space, perfect. So I'm going to take you back down stairs and then we're going to pop out into the garden. If you've got any questions, please just type them in. I'm quite happy to answer them. If you can't think of anything at the moment, but you have some later on, then please don't hesitate to give us a call. We'd be more than happy to help and book you in a viewing. Okay, so just going to pop you through to the garden now. There we go. So as I said, beautiful self-facing garden. Um, our front fender here has, has got this laid to patio, which is lovely, easy to keep, obviously. But lots of pots and flowers and a little shed in the corner here. Lovely little seating area there. Gives you a great example of what you can do. And there's the uh, view to the back of the house, back into, into the lounge. So as I say, this is Claremont Muse, currently on the market for 375,000 pounds. It's a two bedroomed terrace property with parking visitors parking as well very economical perfect location being close to the train station and all the amenities and the beach it would make an ideal property if you're looking for a buy to let or holiday home even but also for you to live in as well so if you'd like to view this property please do give us a call we'd be more than happy to show you around the telephone number is 01843 842 233 thank you